A child is safe after a car is stolen with the two year old inside. As WJTV 12 Jay Biloxa reports, a fiery exchange took place between at least one suspect and Jackson police. Wingfield Drive is where police say two suspects ditched a stolen car with a toddler inside, broke into a home, and then fired shots with officers. The officer did, actually, in, in fact, return fire, and one of the particular suspects was injured. Uh, the second suspect was also taken into custody. An 18-year-old suspect was taken to the hospital listed in serious condition from gunshot wounds. A 15-year-old is in custody. Neighbors heard gunshots. Well, I was down, I had my vacuum clean on, and all of a sudden, pow, 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 you know, about eight pops, and I'm thinking, my vacuum clean is short now, I'm finna, I'm finna blow up something, so I, when I stood my head up, I looked around, I saw all these police officers coming this way, shooting that way. And Before the events on Wingfield Drive unfolded, the two are accused of stealing the car from Elms Court Circle. At this point, that's still under investigation, but we believe that the car may have actually still been uh, been uh, unlocked, rather, at the time that these individuals were able to get inside the car. We don't know exactly what the parent was doing at the time, but we do know that the vehicle was taken from that location. Police are continuing to investigate. Charges are pending.